random number generation in Excel to produce normally distributed data. Here in this Excel sheet, I will use the random number generation to produce normally distributed data for the first variable uh, or group, which is the height. Another one is the weight and then the pulse, the temperature, the hour, and the distance. To generate random number, click on data, then click on data analysis, scroll down to the function random number generation, click on OK, a new window will appear, and for the distribution, select the normal and I'm going to generate number of variables which is one variable and the number of uh, uh, random numbers which is the data points or the cases or the scores so we'll set it up to a hundred and I am going to generate a uh, random numbers that have a mean for the height, let's say 160, and data that have standard deviation of 15. And to generate an output, click on output range, click on the arrow, then select this cell. And once you hit the OK um, icon, a uh, hundred scores has been generated for the height to check the mean and the standard deviation for this data select this cell here click on the data analysis again and select descriptive statistics click on ok and in this window select the input range click in the arrow here select this one this variable which is the height uh, grouped by column labels in the first row and uh, the output range will be inserted in this cell and i'm going to select summary statistics for this occasion or in this occasion click on ok a uh, descriptive data is generated for the first variable which is the height and it has a mean of around 162.3 and the standard deviation of 13.3 so this data is normally distributed to double check that these data are normally distributed select the variable here then select the histogram and the histogram is generated for this data as it is shown here it has a normally distribution and the curve is normal um, and it has a bell shaped curve and also to repeat the same for the weight click on the data select the cell here click on the data click on the data analysis scroll down to the random number generation click on ok and then select this variable here which is the weight we have a number of variable one number of uh, uh, numbers which is 100 and let's say setting the weight as around let's say 65 the mean or i'm going to change that let's say to 85 the mean and with a standard deviation of 10 um, and the output, I'm going to select the output to insert that in this cell. Click on OK. Uh, new data is generated for the weight variable. And supposedly this data is normally distributed and it has a mean and standard deviation that is approximately as it has stated in the setting. For the pulse, again, could repeat the same thing. 
random number generation click on it and then select the range for the pulse let's say from 70 um, and uh, uh, mean of 70 and standard deviation of uh, 20 and select the output range to be inserted in this column and then click on OK again another normally distributed data is generated and we could do the same for the temperature data analysis generation function and then set the mean for let's say the temperature is 37 and the standard deviation of uh, 4 and select the output range into this cell click on ok uh, data is generated for the temperature for the hour again similar thing set to the hour how many hours let's say 12 hours the mean and then standard deviation is 2.5 and uh, the output is set in this cell click on ok again a data is generated here and finally for the distance which is in kilometers i am going to set the parameters here for the mean to be let's say 10 kilometers and standard deviation of 1.5 click on the input range up to here and then you click on ok a data is generated for the distance to check the distribution of the data again select this drag it to here the histogram for the weight shows normally distributed data and for the pulse again normally distributed and for the temperature normally distributed in a histogram for the hours again it's normally distributed with skewness as shown here and finally for the distance it is normally distributed this is the way to generate random number that have normally distributed shape with defined mean and standard deviation in excel